In the UK, when you say cake, people think delicious sponge cakes, chocolate cakes, but in France, when you mention cake, the French think savory, which might sound a bit bizarre, but actually is super tasty. I need 250 grams of plain flour. To my flour, I'm going to add 50 grams of baking powder. I'm just going to put this on the side. I don't need this for the moment. I'm going to use uh, goat's cheese. This is Saint-Maur, and I'm going to chop it up. I love the acidic tang of Saint-Maur, but if you can't find it, any soft goat's cheese will work well. I'm going to chop up my prunes. If you don't want to go down the sweet side, you could do olives. That's really nice. Done my prunes. I'm going to roughly chop pistachios. The pistachios add that beautiful colour and it's got a bit of a crunch and the nutty flavour. Okay, that looks like it's done. Just give it the flour with the baking powder mix. Now add your cheese, nuts and prunes and then you can get on with your batter. Four eggs. Now they need whipping. Luckily, I have something hiding in my cupboard, which will do it for me. That looks like it's done. Pale and fluffy. So look at that. It's lovely fluffy, it's pale in colour. That's how you want it. I'm going to add 150 milliliters of olive oil, 100 milliliters of milk, 50 grams of yogurt, keeps the cake nice and moist. And now I'm going to add some salt, a teaspoon, pepper. I'm going to add my dry ingredients and fold that in. And the reason why you want to fold it in is because if you beat it too hard, then you get a tough cake. Okay, and that is your cake batter. That's all. Really easy. Grab your baking tin, pour it in. If you don't have any baking paper to line your tin, just butter and flour it thoroughly. Now I'm going to put it in the oven. Cook the cake at 180 degrees for about 30 to 40 minutes. Yum, yum, yum. You should just be able to pull it out like this, but it's not happening. Eh, hey, voila. Oh, look at that. Mmm. Smell the cheese. Grab a bread knife and let's have a look and see how turned out. Oh wow, isn't that beautiful? I'm going to cut a little piece off. You're getting the saltiness from the cheese, getting lovely pistachio taste and a little bit of sweetness from the prunes and just all that together in, um, in a cake form works really well. Honestly, I'm not just saying it. <laughs> It's the perfect picnic food and a great alternative to a sandwich.